First tonight at 6, a JCPS female bus driver is recovering from her injuries after allegedly being assaulted this morning by a female parent. Good evening, everyone. I'm Doug Prophet. Police were called to Blake Elementary School in Okalona this morning. The bus driver's union representative says the woman got on the bus, allegedly pulled the driver off and started hitting her. WHS 11's Tabney Dozier is here tonight with reaction. And Tabney, do we know if any students were still on board this school bus? Well, according to the union that represents the bus drivers, Doug, the president tells me students were on board during this alleged assault. He went to the hospital and talked with the bus driver this afternoon, and she told him that's the part that hurts her the most, children witnessing the attack. A JCPS female bus driver recovering from bruises, scrapes, and other injuries. After the bus driver's union says she was assaulted by a Blake Elementary School mother. Oh, they're only doing their job. They're picking your kids up, taking them to school, bring them back home to you in a safe, efficient manner. There's no justification whatsoever they should be physically assaulted by a parent. John Stovall is president of Teamsters Local 783. He says the district has an agreement to provide a safe workplace for drivers. According to Stovall, the bus driver tells him the female parent was upset that the bus driver would not pick up her child from somewhere other than the designated bus stop. Monday morning, while some kids were still on board, Stovall says the parent got onto the bus, drug the driver off, and then assaulted her. It's not okay for those things to happen, and kids are like sponges. You know, they're going to see that, and they're going to think that it's okay. We need the district, when you have something like this, to step up. It's their responsibility to provide a safe workplace for their employees, and they need to step up and make sure this parent, if all this is true, is prosecuted to the full extent of the law. I feel bad for the bus drivers. I mean, they do have to deal with a lot of unnecessary things. Um, I do believe that security should be a bigger issue, so this kind of thing doesn't happen again. The district sent this statement as a response, quote, JCPS cannot comment on pending investigations. However, there is no question JCPS is taking this matter seriously and is working tirelessly to provide a safe environment for all employees and students. The driver was taken by ambulance here to the medical center, Jewish Southwest. That mother, Mrs. DeWitt, that we talked to, she says she did not know about the assault until I asked her for an interview. So she's also upset that Blake Elementary did not make parents aware of what allegedly took place. We have not been told about any arrests so far in this case. I'm Tabby Dozier, WHAS 11 News.